guest today is uh, one of the uh, Joseph Bengali professor, Zeevan uh, Amiya uh, of Sharia. I am Riyadi of the Esquilam. Thank you. The first question I uh, have to you. Thank you. Um, first of all, uh, I would like to thank you for coming and uh, to explain the reason why we have gone to SPLM. Um, first of all, SPLM had been the, the front line party in South Sudan. And it brought us independence and um, brought us a new country. And we had some um, misunderstandings within the party. But of course, when you have a misunderstanding at home, the best thing is you you sort them out and then see what is the best way to disintegrate or to come to, together. So we decided that this is a historic party in the country. <clears throat> and as a result, why should we make the country to fail, I mean, the party to fail just because of anger, just because of hatred, just because of um, maybe mismanagement and so on? I think the best thing is to to come together and uh, make a history in our lifetime. Okay. Thank you. <coughs> Did you leave SPLM at that time? I never left SPLM in writing or um, in anything. What happened is during the 2010 election, in the, um, in the electoral law, it stipulated very clear that if you are not chosen by the party hierarchy to run as a flag bearer of the party, an individual can decide to run as independent. So when I ran independent as SPLM, this was not accepted by the leadership. No, I mean after the independence, you leave the independent. No, we didn't leave the, that's what I'm explaining. I'm saying the scenario started during the 2010 election, where people, a lot of people split because of misunderstanding within the, um, the electoral process. So as a, an independent candidate, um, the leadership sought, um, I disobeyed them. So I did everything to, to be accepted, to be loved, to be part of the system, part of the party. <clears throat> But it was difficult. So I decided quietly and said, OK, let me leave chance for us to begin thinking what to do next. You know, when, um, when, when you are boiling um, any food and then the steam is bubbling, you, you, don't, you, keep it, you leave it, give it time. Time will come, all of you will come together and say, I think then it will begin to calm down. <laughs> So the, the tension and differences after the 2010 election began to come down. And we began to realize 
where mistakes were and where mistakes were not. Then after that, we, like the new language now, we revitalize our thinking. To say, what are we going? Are we leaving this giant party, that historical party that brought us independence, that made us South Sudanese as a country? Do we leave it just because we had differences? For me, not all of us, for me, I said, we must come back. Reconcile our ranks and then move the party forward. The rest will join as time goes. <clears throat> it is just like uh, anywhere in the world. The same government can bring war, the same government can bring prosperity. So it is something that is common. Even in America, the giant country. The same Republican Party can bring war. The same Republican Party can bring peace. But they didn't bring war to America. Where? They didn't bring war to America, the Republican Party. Because you are not an American. The Americans know their system. You are not an American. Let us talk about South Sudan. It was just an example. So in Africa and in South Sudan, why do families, a man and his wife fight, and yet they live together? Does it mean, uh, it is natural that in a family there must be conflict, and then you, you settle the conflict. That is not natural. A South Sudan cannot be an exception. And the SPLM cannot also be an exception. There are so many parties <coughs> that emerge. Later, they fall apart. And then later, they come together. OK, you are, you are talking about the difference that let you uh, pull out from the SPL. What kind of? You know, in a party system, people are equal. You are not a second class SPLM. I'm not a second class SPLM. We are SPLM. Only the hierarchy differentiate us from you, me from you. You can be the chair, I can be the secretary, and the other one. But when it is the, the, the issue of, um, <coughs> some people feel they are more SPLM than the others. So that, that will not be accommodative for many people. And as a result, then people fall apart one by one, one by one, but later, we are saying these are issues that can happen in any family, in any organization. But if the leadership is strong, you can contain by bringing everybody on board and say, we have gone wrong. Let us go this way. Thank you. OK, then after joining re SPM, are, are, are you feeling that you are more SPM than others? No, I'm just SPLM as anybody, as any other SPLM member. That is what we want. Uh, there, there is no way I can say I'm a better SPLM than the other one. Because everybody contributed in SPLM, in SPLA, um, at his or her level. You contribute in a, in a small form, that is contribution. So coming back, I feel proud that I'm making history that we have to maintain the party that brought us a country of our own. And then from here, we shall begin the reform which is necessary <coughs> to make sure that we don't fall into the same mistake in the What the deal that brought you back to SPLM? When I joined SPLM, I, I didn't have a deal. When I exit, I didn't have a deal. I'm coming back home, I, I don't have a deal. Why should I have a deal to return home? Okay, who start talking with you to rejoin the SPLM? The public, the, my constituency in Western Equatoria in South Sudan, the leadership of the SPLM, we ourselves within our organization, 
different people, different stakeholders. Who is that? Th that's what I've mentioned. I need names. No, 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 no. My, I cannot bring, give you 1,000 names. I cannot give you that name. No, but you what I'm saying. You can bring two names. Huh? Two names. Okay, let me say myself. I, I, I revitalize myself to begin talking to myself and say, where am I going? Where am I heading? First of all, my own constituency is divided. Some are SPLM, some are not SPLM. Just because they look at me as somebody who could bring them together. Now, when they are divided in this manner, what do we do? Do I continue seeing my people divided? No. Do I continue to see South Sudan divided? Let me begin, and the rest will follow. If they don't follow, it is up to them. But I'm trying to make good history, not bad history, in the sense that our children will not know how South Sudan became an independent country. Who made it? There must be something that made it to be independent, and that is SPLM. So why should we... Yeah, should, should there be uh, a problem uh, than a solution to unity of South Sudanese people behind a party that brought us independence? Of um, if, uh, I'm still looking for your answer. Yes. Can you mention two names of those who come and sit and talk with you and convince you to, return, to rejoin the SPL? I think the question may, may be out of place. Because it's not it is out of place because I've, I've said, listening to the public, listening to the constituencies, listening to me, myself, I, myself, understanding what happened in the past. So how do I name public to you? How do I do that? No, OK. Hmm? As an individual, if I just tell you, Peter told me, OK. What is the benefit of saying Peter? Archangel told me to come back. Does it make any difference? Yeah, it will make any difference. Okay, Archangel told me to come back. No, no, we are talking about. <laughs> okay, who's from uh, the leader of the Spellum? The what? From the, from the leadership of Spellum. Who comes and talks to you? From the leadership of the Spellum? Okay, where is the leadership? It starts from from uh, the chairman or yeah. from where? The chairman. I think you are you are leading me to to, to to a wall which which is not correct. I'm saying everybody, and you can see when I declared last uh, when was that the last fifteenth of uh, of July. What was the comment? Did you get the comment on social media? Yes. These are the people who were talking to me. Now, after declaring, did you see what happened on social media? These were the expectation of the people. So if I begin counting them one by one, whom am I going to leave out? And uh, Because also, I'll be condemned by an individual. <coughs> I didn't mention his name. Because everybody wants to, to be proud that he is the one who convinced me to, to come back. So if I don't mention your name, what will be the, the, the repercussion? The only thing that the social media itself can verify and can testify that the public wanted me to come back, and I've come back. We can go ahead. Okay, uh, have you talked to the chairman of the party after the journey? I'm making an arrangement to talk to him. So you didn't talk to him? No, I've not talked to him. You didn't meet him? Of course, it is a matter of uh, arrangement and uh, schedule. If you are not given your schedule, we have made the. Uh, um, uh, an application to meet the, to, to brief him and uh, to tell him and to, to say I've come back. So I've not done it yet. He didn't call you? Call me? Yeah, after. No, he has not called me yet. But that's, it is not a matter of calling only. It is a matter of um, asking for permission or a schedule to meet the chairman, which I've done. I'm waiting any day. I'm called, I will go to say what I want to say. But I've already uh, filed uh, uh, a petition to see the chairman. Mm. Okay, okay. Uh, some people are saying that it was the national security or Akol Kur himself who started 
talks with you to rejoin. I think that is the common, common language in South Sudan. Very common. And uh, I cannot be an exception to be having a labor that way. That is, that, that, that is what is happening here. That it, when you decide, it is the person who decides. Nobody can say, you have decided as a man. Every, every time anything happens in South Sudan, they fix on something else. That is the common. So I don't, I don't worry about that. Okay. No, I'm not worried about whatever they say that it is so and so who talk to me. I don't worry about it because it is a common, common situation in the country. Even if I decide today, say I'm, um, I'm going, I, I, I've left politics, they will not say it is me who decided. They will fix it on somebody. So it is a common thing. So when, when somebody decides, why should it be only another person who is deciding for me? And the South Sudanese know me very well. When I decide, I decide. I don't, I'm mean, not uh, deciding on, or somebody is deciding on my behalf. I, I know what I'm doing. And I know what, where I'm going. Okay. Mm. Thank you. We are living to Sowa. It is a ministry, it is a public institution. It was not created for Sowa, neither created for any party. It was created <coughs> for the country. So if I am occupying, I will occupy it as long as I'm relieved. When I'm relieved, I leave it and, uh, and be ready for anything. Thank you. The position is for the party, not for you. Mm -hmm. Does it make sense? SOA is an umbrella organization. Then within the organization, we have eight parties. Each party has its own allocation. Each part within SOA has its own allocation or position. So when you are given your position, <coughs> I'm not in this position because of SOA. It is an NMC, it was an NMC position given to me. It is just like when you, when food is brought to the table, and each one is given a plate to pick yours. Self-service. So I picked my portion in my, in my plate. If I want to sell it, if I want to give it to somebody, to, do, does the, the table ask me why should I give the food I collected on the table to somebody else? Uh, does it work like that? So, it, it, you know, South Sudan, has a problem. Everybody is looking at the positions. So that's why when somebody lack a position, then he will fight the other one to get that one. But we are all partners. It is not segregation. Politics is not about segregation. Politics is not about hate. We get together, do your part, I do my part, then we shall meet somewhere. <coughs> But uh, it, is, uh, it is very common that people are looking only at positions. Even if you have a position, you need also to get another one so that you have two. Otherwise, whoever is claiming the position has a position, has a post. 
But because of this alliance, alliance are binding people together. And within the alliance, one is free to exit. You are free to exit. So when you exit with your family, with your properties, with the whatever was given to you, so why should it be a crime that I can exit from SOA as an entity, join my, my mother party with what I have in hand, and it becomes a problem for others that this is our property. Even whoever is claiming within SOA has his own share there. No. All yeah. the shares no. were distributed. So what happened? No, we are talking about it. Mm. It's not for you. It's, it's for your former party. Mm -hmm. Which is part and and I'm, I'm, I'm the principal within the party. Have you agreed with them? Those who do not agree, that is our own point. Because I'm the principal. So, if you disagree with me, you go your way. Because I'm the principal in, in, within the party. So if Kiri today, the, the, the president, or Riak, or anybody, decide, please, this is the direction we go. If you don't like to go, then what is your fate? We have gone this way. And you just adamantly refuse. So why should it, why should your crime or anything mistaken be labeled on me? So that is also again another way of insubordination. Yeah, because we have agreed. Let us go this direction. Like in in the front line, the commander said we go this way. Other soldiers say we are going our way, and they form another group this way and say, no, we are remaining. So what, what, now, how do you judge this situation here? The same is for the party, not for you. Does it make mm. sense? But, so. I, I'm, I, but I'm the principal of the party. Mm. What does the law say? Okay. Uh, is a logic? If it is not logic for some, it will be logical for others. So the, the logic cannot be 100% equal to everybody. That's why, in another way, what is good for you may not be good for me. And then we negotiate and find, OK, where can we meet? So the, the best thing is not to raise a row. The ministry is public. The president appoints people to the ministry. So. According, if, if according to what? According to what? According to the agreement. My is the president who appoints it. There's nobody who, who appointed me. So in case you have a complaint, file your case to the, to the president. And uh, let us see. Let us sit down to, to find out where can we agree and disagree. It is not a matter of accusation only just for the sake because I want uh, a ministry, even if I give a ministry to either to SOA or to what, how will they distribute one ministry among themselves when they have already other ministries? So it, it is not uh, the issue. The, the problem here is that can we understand each other? <coughs> can we sit? Maybe you can convene a meeting for us to sit with the other group and say, where do we, where do we agree here? And then we can see what, what is the, the, the middle ground. Hmm. Okay. Don't you think it's kind of Nyakama, what you are doing now? Nyakama is when you, you grab it, the other one is grabbing, then you can tear even if there is a, 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 maybe food here in a, in a bag. Yeah. Um, you, can, you, you can, you can. How do you grab uh, an institution? That, that is not uh, any place. You cannot grab an institution. It's not my property. How do I grab it? I don't have it in the pocket to grab or in your pocket. It is an institution for the country. So anybody can fit there. Whoever is placed there, go ahead. Until your time comes, leave it. 
any position in the country is a public institution. It doesn't belong to, to me as a Bakosoro. The, the work I'm doing here is for the nation. I'm not doing it for a party. Whether you hold it or you don't hold it, we, the, the public service is for the country. So I cannot grab as if I'm taking it home. Grabbing is you take it home. And you have the power to grab. I don't have the power to grab. So this, this is where we, sometimes uh, no, there are certain information which are misleading. OK, you don't have the power, but you rejoin the SPM. Mm -hmm. You have to deal with them. So what do, you, what do you expect me to do, to say? To say what? To decree, to and decree myself, or how do you do that? Maybe they, they give you something like this. Because I'm telling you, who have a power, I'm so sincere. Now you are a member. I'm so sincere every time people know me about my straightforwardness. I'm, I'm not dodging anything here and there. There is no agreement that says I will come and be given this and that. Why should I bring all these conditions when I'm just returning home? Well, so what is the problem? I give you condition to return home. These, these are all statements uh, flying across. Because you have your analysis, and the question you are giving me is based on your analysis. The answer I'm giving is based on my conviction, what I know. So what you analyze, you hear on social media, I want to become my vice president, I want to become uh, water secretary again. These are all analysis of the people. So don't depend on analysis. Get the first-hand information from me that I'm not promised. I was not promised anything. But if anything comes to me as a government official, I will take it. Because I'm serving the nation. I'm not going to serve myself or any institution just as a personal property. I'm going to serve the nation. I am not aware of that. Never. How how uh, how long should I say I'm not aware of that? Okay, if I'm promised, maybe you know better. But I, for me, I don't know. If you know that I was promised something, then uh, tell me. Maybe you saw us discussing with the president or with the who, who who gave me this promise. You know, there are certain things, there are certain analyses which are sometimes very, uh, I mean, uh, awkward in a way. In social media, you can hear that the president met with so and so, and they agreed to do one, two, three. Who was there to report? They were two. That means it is the president who, who, who released the information, or that individual who released the information. So sometimes when you get these things, people begin to panic. The president said this, you were promised this, but I'm telling you now, I've never been promised anything. I just came. I want also to contribute in SPLM, to promote SPLM forward, to, make sure, to, 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 to convince the people that this is a historical party. If you have a conflict within the party, let us sort them out and move the party forward. That is, that is the reason why I'm here. Not necessarily because only of position. Position will come when the time comes. Okay, so, so, uh, do you think SPM is still great party? For now, I can tell you that SPLM is still great. It's still a, a huge party. It's still a dynamic party. The only problem we need to do now is to reform the SPLM, to make it what people want, to bring peace to the country, to bring prosperity to the country. So and these, these items, I'm mentioning them, are not automatic. They will come gradually. And so I, I feel that uh, SPLM is still great. We just need to revisit where we are coming from, where we are now in SPLM, and where do we want to head to in the future. That is what we want to do. OK. And what is your proposal to reform SPLM? 
I have an interest to see SPLM prospering and growing without division among members, addressing our internal affairs amicably, and reaching a solution, and without labeling or categorizing members of the SPLM into different categories. First class SPLM, second class SPLM, the periphery SPLM. No. We need the people. If you begin to, to segregate members of the party, then it becomes difficult for the party to grow. So if we can have this in place, SPLM will grow bigger. And so coming back to SPLM is to make sure that to contribute in a way, not to make sure, because you may try to make sure and the assurance will not be there. But at least to, to educate the people. The, the, the failure of our SPLM system is we don't have political school to educate the young ones so that they take over. These are some of the things. If, if you have a, a, SPLA, a SPLM political school in place, brothers, SPLM will be the most strongest because we shall know the history. The young ones will know the history and where we are heading to. And uh, SPLM should not be the first party in Africa to just collapse within short time. It, it depends on some of us. And we, we feel which history are we making? If we can leave a party that brought us a whole country, a whole nation, we are now a nation. And if uh, next tomorrow somebody asks you, how did you become a nation? We just say we fought. Fought where? How? There is an institution that made us to fight and reach the conclusion, and that institution is still existing. The NC, the NRA, NRM in, in, uh, in, um, in Uganda, uh, Kanu led for nearly 60 years in, in Kenya, and the rest. So why should we only be the first to fail our history? Okay. Uh, what is your plan after we go into My plan is what I'm telling you. This is what I have in mind, to reform what went wrong in the SPLM, if I'm given a chance. Not given a chance in the sense that it is me to do it. But let us have this chance to negotiate, discuss, and find where we went wrong and where we can go right. That is, that, that is the collective information about reform. It doesn't mean it is one aspect. So uh, my, my, my plan, is the, the, the priority now, is to visit two, three, four states to tell them this is the direction we need to go. Let us go this way. And also to apologize to the public as the SPLM members. You know, we have, we have a lot of uh, people in refugee camps, in displaced camps, and uh, some people, some villages are deserted and so on. As you said before, because SPLM is the cause. OK, if SPLM is the cause, why don't we go to apologize to those people and then come up with a, a, a revitalized plan, a plan that will move the party forward and, and make it prosper in the country? Okay, you have apologized no, I'm a, about, about, about what they did for you and what they Maybe you didn't understand me. I'm saying, no, I'm you, you said earlier that... Um, uh, SPLM is the cause of what is happening in the country. So I'm saying one of the proposals I have in mind is to go to the public, to go to the constituency, and then apologize to them, and then move the movement forward or the party forward. This is what I'm saying. Yeah. Yeah, um, I'm talking about you are facing a lot of challenges. challenges. Where you are a governor and the rest of the 
I don't think it will be possible uh, to apologize to me as an individual. SPLM can apologize to the nation because uh, who am I? An individual. The whole party is apologizing to me. Uh, th these are mistakes which happen in the family. So I, I, I cannot just say they should apologize or I should apologize to them. Unless I did what was worse, maybe as an individual, I can ap uh, apologize to the party. But the party needs only to, to think and say, how do we bring our cadres to, to, together on board? This is the, the, the work of the party now. How do we bring those who went out to come back? Because they went for different reasons, so to bring them back. So um, the issue of apology is mainly the party to the public, who are the, 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 the custodians, the, or the constituency of the SPLM party. OK, thanks, uh, Honorable Minister. Bye for now until we have another guest.